Welcome to the advice for the week 12 real-time case solution. Now this is going to be something where we're doing it differently from how we've done it before. So, new rules, new conditions. First thing is it's going to be a 12 hour window of submission. The assignment will open, the assignment will close. It will be worth 30 marks, so there's 30 points on offer for the taking. The word length is up to you. Now it's 12 hours, it's 30 points, and I'm going to say be reasonable, be realistic, and give yourself the space to achieve what you want to achieve in that time and in the answer that you present. If you present a hyper short, less than a page answer, I will assume that you want me to mark you quickly, briefly, and with not many points. If you present me a manuscript of immense proportions, I will be questioning how you pulled it off in a 12 hour window, and I'll be assuming that you didn't get the core focal point of the question. So, since you've got the co-creation option in terms of length, space, and what you're working with, Here's what you are going to co-produce. You will be given a case. That case is going to set your scenario. And in response to your scenario, you are going to need to give some advice. The question, the fundamental question you are addressing is this. Given the company's position as outlined in the case, what is the next step you would take? How would you explain this decision to the organization in terms of the application of the ideas, theories, or practices of services marketing? I am asking you for your view, your opinion. I'm not asking you to generate a perfect opinion as created by somebody else. I'm asking you to step up and say, as a services marketer, this is how I would take the next step. To that end, the criteria for the assessment task. Criteria one, it's worth 20% of the overall final assessment tasks grade. And that is a clear, concise, precise statement of the next step. Your next step must connect directly to a specific issue raised in the case. And it's our next step. I would preference a single focused use of services marketing as a guide. If you want to go with multiple elements though, prioritize and get a rank order up. Don't just throw me a handful of solutions with no way of me being able to determine which was the most important. But also, don't try to solve everything in the one next step. There are many steps on this journey. You're being asked to go from where they are now to what is the thing that you would do next to create your solution. Criteria two is I want you to explain that solution. I want you to tell me why. Step one, tell me what you'd do next. Tell me why. Tell me why it's a good idea. Show me the theories, the ideas, the elements, the stuff from services marketing that makes this decision a good decision. So I'm looking for reasoning. I'm looking for argument. I'm looking for it to be internally consistent. If there are elements of the case that you pick up and run with, those need to be the important elements. If the next step is not consistent with the explanation, and the explanation with, is not consistent with the next step, this is where it will go wrong for you. And to that end, I need to be able to see how it connects to the case. No generic advice, no generic talking about services marketing in the abstract connect it to the context of the case study.
In step three, application of services marketing knowledge. Step two is your argument, your rationale, your use of the technique, your justification through content. And this is how well you've used your content. How have you justified, supported, and backed yourself with materials you've covered this semester? And specifically, how have you applied from the vast array of tools a specific block of services marketing content to create an answer to the problem that you've identified as the priority next step to address, to solve in the case study. Now, if you want to run uh, sans reference, without reference, you can. Uh, it'll bring you up to the distinction. If you want to slug it out for, the, for this band, the application of services marketing knowledge on this band, if you want to be banking ultra high, super high, or high distinction, there needs to be referencing support in play. If you've got no desire to run with the references, you just want to tell your story as it is, then you'll cap out on this criteria at distinction, but you will not cap out overall on steps one or step two. You won't be in the hunt for the 100% without references, but you will be in the hunt for the high grades if you are presenting me something that is your take on the next step and what block of services marketing thinking you would use to make it work for you.